Greetings out of these and guardians, my name is Hyper Himes and welcome back to Kick Your Run Oven Break, where since the new update came out introducing the brand new Schneeball cookie, and considering that this is now the, uh, it's like the Time Relic Chaos, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called, or just something to do with relics going into chaos, that's what we're going to be doing exactly right now today. I already made my video focusing on the new cookie being Schneeball, but now we have Time Relic Chaos. Mmm. I can't flipping wait, because right now it just looks like, uh, is that, I thought that was a heart for a moment, but I think... Closer, look at it. I thought that was a heart. It wasn't, but then I looked even closer. That's a worm inside there, or like a snake. It's like a raccoon tail snake. I don't even know how to explain it. But I want you to know before I actually ended up, uh, you know, playing on this, I wanted to do a little bit of an old view of my old playthrough of Operation Time Fixers, which was the update with Coffee Candy and Baguette. And I just want to recap on some of my voices I did for the characters, because you know we're gonna be seeing Marble Bread soon, and we're also gonna be seeing Maple Taffy here. So I had to stick with the times, you know. But let's go ahead and jump into this and get some story started. Hmm. New relics are here. Okay, uh, quick. <laughs> did, I, did I just show What accident? Did I, did I do Austria? What did I just do? That was entirely accidental, by the way. Uh, quick. We must see this. Alright, sure. I guess we're gonna go to Time Education, Relic Management Division. And the other thing is Time Support, Facility Management Division. Alright, sure. I guess we're gonna deal with cleaning a relic or something. And we're starting off with the first cutscene. I'm recording this early in the morning, so if you hear any sort of trucks outside, I am sorry. It's literally 6 a.m. by the time they record this. What are all those in your hand? And you seem very unnecessarily energetic as usual. <laughs> Slams the box. That was me when I got my cookie run of a break uh, package for the Witch's Castle. Well, it's actually Witch's Castle package, but that was me. <laughs> of course, I'm happy and energetic because look at all these new relics. Come take a look, Schneeball Cookie. I think we might have found lots of rare ones. Not many know the value of old things, but, well, it's better for me. That means I always have plenty to collect. Right. Are these, uh, are these Millennial Forest grassroots? I've never seen this structure before. I'll have to break it open and see what's inside. What? What are you talking about? You're gonna break? What? You, you can't break open every relic you see, Schneeball Cookie. But all you do is put them on the display case and just let it sit there for ages. P preserving relics is important, sure, but studying them is also very, very important. Whoa, 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 step away from the relic, and just go do your studying, research, and just do whatever you do. Shoo, shoo, shoo. I once, I will once you, I will once you hand that to, oh, oh, so that was confusing me. I will once you hand that to me. Come back here. Hmm, why is the relic manager division always so chaotic? The dark, dark, the dark, dark fondue cookie. Maple Taffy Cookie, Schneeball Cookie, I'm here about a disciplinary case regarding the damage to an ancient historic site. I told you to research, not destroy the ruins. Because you've made such a spectacular mess, it has become very troublesome for me to arrange everything to clean up after you. You won't be able to avoid the penalties this time. But y y y y you see, things happen when you do research. Like, how about understanding the mind of a genius scholar? G generously. I am not feeling generous about this situation. I do things the way they are supposed to be done. Besides, remember when you went into the director's office without permission? That's not going to end well in disciplinary time. Or dis in the disciplinary line. Feel free to do it again and see what happens. Personally, I think it will be quite entertaining to watch. <laughs> I, I, I was just... I, I was so curious about that form that I, I haven't... I've never seen before. Anyway, what, what do I need from you? Clean, clean the hallways? <laughs> Let me see. Writing up an official disciplinary letter sounds reasonable, right? At least 10 pages. What? Oh, how cruel! And have you forgotten that you are the head of a relic management? Are you not able to manage your employees properly? A lot of our expenses go into this division, and to be honest, most of it is to pay for the damaged item Schneeball Cookie cracked open. <laughs> right. Your scolding's longer than usual today. Of course. It's because there are so many problems to talk about. Problems that this division has caused. But everyone is in our division is doing a great job of their own. Even Schneeball Cookie is flawless when it comes to individual skills. Why, why, yes, of course. There's no cookie in the division who can match my skills, even when it comes to analyzing relics. Vandalism is only a tiny part of the research process. The audacity. I think I'll need to double-check the standards for this division at Cookie Resources. Is that a... Is that a snail? <laughs> I thought that was like a hedgehog or like swirl thing. <laughs> oh, uh, by the way, take a look at this dark found view, Kikia. I think I made a great discovery. Ten pages by this afternoon. Understood? Uh, uh that's, that's pretty cold. It really looks very old, but it's pretty peculiar. I wonder what it is. A fossil, perhaps? <laughs> Imagine that ticking is actually like, that's actually Schneeball Kiki, like, trying to tap into the relic that you hear just... It, like, it's, I don't know why, it just matches the music. 
Let me see it. Fossils are relics with many secrets. Just one tap with this hammer and... Oh. The little secret about is to be reve The little secret is about to be revealed to the world. Be careful, this knee block cookie. We need to preserve it later. If you break this too, I'll file a complaint. Uh, I'll file a claim to your division. I almost said complaint, but I guess both can work as well. P please, quiet, both of you. I need to focus. Uh huh. If I just tap this groove here, like so, there. Oh, butterfly-shaped key. I don't think I've ever seen something like this before. What era do you think it's from, Schneeball Kiki? I don't know. I'll have to do a little bit more research, but it's definitely something I've never seen before. I wonder what it was for. Yeah, there's something that looks like it can be pressed. C careful, Maple Taffy Cookie. We don't know what this relic is. Like, we don't even know what it does. And what if something... Oh. Ah! <laughs> so Maple Taffy is just dead now. Okay. Hmm. Excavating a new relic heart alone is going to be harder than I thought. But I don't want to ask Maple Taffy for help again. Somewhere in the department might be some helpful clues. I may have to take a look around. Okay, so... First of all, surprisingly, we're not trying to look for another cookie this time. We're just trying to complete... Oh, no, wait. We got to meet Croissant Cookie. Never mind. Okay, and it does seem like there's a lot more missions to be done. Like, 100 million points, 40 million, uh, 500 jellies in total. And I wonder how long these will take. Oh, well, I don't expect them, but luckily, like... Wait, is my magic... My magic candy's not at level 1, right? Oh, oh, oh! I know what it's doing. It's just telling you what you need as a recommended choice. Because if I go over here, max... Okay, so that's max right here. Okay, but isn't there something that tells you... Okay, that's for bonus. I guess it's telling you, like, hey, here's stuff that you can run with that's recommended. I don't know. That's It's a, it's a weird system that it kind of confuses me in my personal opinion, but... uh, mm. I had to take a swig of water right there, but... I guess let's go ahead and try and search for a croissant cookie, which, to be fair, we definitely should not try and uh, mess with uh, either Dark Fart and... Do, and wait... Did, did she say she didn't want to mess with, like, coffee candy? I think that's a cookie that- that's one cookie she probably, like, talked to. Then again, I feel like- Oh, wh what? What? Oh, okay. The heck was that? Okay. Uh, sure. At least we're getting a lot of jellies transforming into bear jellies. That's good. You know, and also that little gingerbread running around. Honestly, I'm excited because, first of all, you know, new update. That means I can just binge a lot of videos, but I can also binge a lot of videos for Kingdom 2. And that actually gives me more, more time to work on other videos, like for your local plug, because I have some cool things coming up. Uh, one video that I was originally working on, which it's still going to take some time to make. Then again, I say that with so many videos, you have no idea. Like, I think my friends really want me to make another Lethal Company video with all the footage that I have of them, which I have a lot more footage to use up. Which I definitely need to turn those into videos, but of course when oven break updates be calling, oven, uh, oven break updates be calling. But also another thing is I really like working on shorts. Like I want to try and get like a fax short. Oh my, what the heck? My game just froze right there. Like I didn't get the magnet. I don't know what that was about. Uh, but uh, here's the thing. When do we meet croissant cookie? Because now, oh wait, oh whoa. Do you see that? It actually tells you like a little percentage thing of like a current mission. I mean, it doesn't tell you every single mission, but it actually tells you, like, a percentage of it you have completed, which is actually pretty sweet. It's over to the right of the screen instead of the top left, which I'm not sure if that's more, more in the way, but uh, probably not because it's a little bit more ahead. But then again, if it's behind you, you don't need to really worry about anything being behind you. Uh, but these are definitely longer runs, I will admit, because uh, we haven't even met Croissant Cookie in our first run. And luckily, it is starting off... Uh, it's starting us from where we left off, as you can see in the bottom right. It should say, yeah, start from where you fell. So we still need to find progress to find Croissant Cookie, which... This is a lot... Man, did they buff up these? Like, it's taken 12... That's a lot of coins, sheesh! Maybe they tried to up the ante with this event, because maybe it was too easy, just normal mode. I don't know, but let's go ahead and give this another run. Let's see how far we can get, and let's see if we can even find croissant cookies. Right now, we still need a good amount of jellies, which we're, we're clearly we're near the percentage of, and there we go, it's completed. Oh, that was close. I got scared for a moment there. Uh, get that, get that, get that. Now we just need uh, a bunch of points left in total, which... Wait, am I doing these missions one at a time? Because I swear, I would have had more points than that in total ever since the last run. I think we're doing these missions one at a time, I think. Oh, no, wait, no, 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 because, no, the point value is going down instead of going up. Oh, this is so unique. I will, It's, like, simple changes, but, like, I really do appreciate them because, like, they're small, but, like, I don't know, they maybe make them a little bit more interesting. But now I just need to meet Croissant Cookie, and, oh, there we go. Oh, we got all missions completed. Oh, that's great. Okay. Schneeball Kiki, I found a strange fossil while time traveling. Would you, uh, would you be able to analyze it? Uh, of course, he came to the right kicky. I must have not been easy bringing this giant fossil in. Hmm, an old statue. 
The way that it's structured, I'm guessing it's one of those statues that the Kiki used to display in their temples. Huh, it could be a statue from the City of Millennial. I've always wanted to study it. Really? Well, I'm glad you found it helpful. Thank you for your donation, but don't forget about what I mentioned last time. Uh, if you ever find it, a donation of that will be very helpful. Uh, the time craft I modified? It's the most interesting piece of technology. I, it would be difficult to maintain it in a good state if you just leave it for a long time. I'd say it's best to leave it in the Relic Management Division, uh, since, you know, we're the experts here. Can I do that when it actually becomes a relic after a very long time? I, I want to keep it close to me because every time I look at it, it reminds me of why I'm doing this. Of course, I respect that. I'll be waiting then. Hopefully it's not too far from the future of TBD standards. Okay, and now we're... Whoa! Whoa, it continues our run! Oh, that's, that's cool! Okay, I'm sorry, but that's the change I really like. I really like how after you meet the cookie, you still continue with your run. That is awesome! I know it's a small detail, but oh my gosh, I love that so much. Uh, it's small, but also I'm done with the mission, so I can actually end that there, but... Mmm, that is amazing. I love that. Okay, so they definitely added a good amount of changes, but for what it's worth... This is goaded. This is amazing. And also, I just realized I can go ahead and take all these and, uh... What? You get a free co You get a free croissant cookie in Cosmo's gear just for doing it? Oh my gosh, that's so generous. I think my croissant cookie already is max, though. But that's so generous! Yeah, it just goes to mileage. Now we're all ready to excavate relics in their best possible condition. Claim your reward and let's move on to the next stage. Well, actually, don't I need to re collect the rest of the rewards? Like, for example, if I go ahead and claim all this stuff, which, by the way... Oh, but it seems like they lower the... Did they lower the amount of gems? Or maybe this is just for normal mode. Okay, wait. Wait, I... I didn't even do all the missions. Plus, I, I didn't even do all the missions. I only did, like... I... Because I, there were two left I could have collected coins for. Are you telling me you don't need to do all the missions? Oh, they are heavily modifying this game mode, and I have no clue for it. Oh my gosh. Mm. All right, new cutscene time. It's just Dark Fondue just witnessing that fateful Taffy probably just died. And Schneeball. And again, he got himself into trouble. Uh, such a troublesome boss I have. I mean, uh, this, this is a troubling matter. I guess we should save him since he has 10 pages to submit. Is it really necessary? I, I could just write that. This might be a great chance for you to make me the head of the Relic Management Division. I am always well prepared, you know. Would you like to see my portfolio? Well, as you know, only competent cookies get promoted. So if you could save Maple Taffy Cookie, maybe that qualifies you as the head of this division. Hmm, I'm not sure if Maple Taffy Cookie really is that competent. Why does it feel like you have higher standards for me? Well, I need those statements written by Maple Taffy Cookie and not someone else. It must be signed by the manager. Or, if you can somehow get a signed copy of Maple Taffy Cookie's statement letter, that could also work. And you won't need to save him from the relic. Okay, I, I'll make sure to get him for you. Great. Now, I'm terribly busy with other work, so I must get going. Good luck. Well, it wouldn't matter if both of you lose your jobs at this point. That actually might be the best outcome for our department. You know, you say the most sinister things with a smile on your face. I'll, 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 get, I'll get to work. I'm glad that she's actually being honest with Dark Fondue. Imagine just being like, you know, if you both died, that'd actually be better for her job. Sure, saving him is important, but I'm more interested in that relic. I really want to break it open and study what's inside. Okay, time to crack open the relic, or, I mean, rescue Maple Taffy Cookie. Uh, I need more light to get a closer look. If looking at the outside doesn't give you an answer, it's probably wise to look inside, right? I can't see anything to estimate which era this is from, but by the looks of the fine workmanship, it's probably not that ancient. I think I'll know better once I crack it open. If Maple Taffy, if Maple Taffy Cookie was in here, he would have freaked out. But he isn't here, so it should be okay. And if I can't rescue him even after breaking it open like this, he just has bad luck. I, I'm, I'm doing, I'm, I'm doing the best I can, so don't blame me. She just wants to avoid any sort of like affiliate. What is going on? What? Where? Where? Where am I? What is? What is this place? It's so dark in here, and I can't, I can't see anything. I was also going to say, like, Schneeball Cookie's really tried to uh, devoid herself at any responsibility of what this is going on for her. So Maple Taffy gets screwed, she's just going to be like, eh, oops. That's what she's going to be like. Uh-oh. I think I know who that is. Huh? Who's there? 
excavation plan two separate uh separate the surface okay well i want to go here now but the thing is which wait a second here's the thing because this is multiple stages stage two and stage three maybe this is like stage two and stage three and then the next one will be stage one because like here's the thing uh let's go over to our collection how many cutscenes are in this no 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 that's our, that's our diary but oh sure i'll take all that that's a lot of... why did it just give me so much uh okay collection uh go over to the cutscene list uh if i what no wait this is let's uh kick the action <laughs> uh scroll all the way down here timer of the chaos so there's uh multiple sets of story how many episodes I, I guess maybe I still can't do this with like multiple episodes depending on how long it takes me because technically I could do like two stories for three and four and then another video for five and six but then what's next after that kneeball cookie and Chris oh yeah these are the meetup cutscenes which we have onion and I think that was baguette yeah and then the la these last ones are like the mission ones yeah there's six okay I got you so it is the same except they just decide to add more stages which I don't know if that's gonna pan the runtime of videos but if anyone's interested and now I have to wait do I have to run with the croissant cookie well, I guess it's required, because now, for some reason, I'm running with croissant. Huh. This is really weird, because it did just give me croissant cookie, and there's also collect points with... Are the, are the missions getting harder? Because I have to run with both croissant cookie and also uh, plum and schneeball cookie. I don't know how this is going to work, so this may be pretty interesting once I start to get down to... Uh, try to get down to stuff, because there is a mission... Uh, Wait. There's, there's no meeting mission. There's no meat mission to meet like baguette cookie. This is going to be really interesting to see how this works. But whatever the case is, I'm going to end the video right here. Because uh, there's, of course, other videos I need to work on. And uh, you know, I'm excited for what this update has to offer. But with that being said, if you enjoy the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it. And also share the video with your friends if you enjoy my Kicker Run content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe? And also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. Also, down below in the description, you will see links to all of my social media, including a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get a Kicker on YouTube stuff for absolutely free. A link to my Discord server called the Hype Beast Hub. A link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel and lastly a link to my Kofi, where for just one dollar a month you can see exclusive videos that you wouldn't normally see in this normal youtube channel and just content in general too but above all else i will see you entities and guardians in the next video hail the hype beast.